Here's how easy it is to get your cross-functional teams working better together with everyone on the right JIRA. When you think of JIRA, you might think of software teams, Sprints, Agile, Scrum, Kanban, but now there's a completely redesigned JIRA purpose-built for teams like marketing, design, program management, and so much more. It's called JIRA Work Management, and you can get started today. First off, JIRA Work Management has over 20 templates for all kinds of teams and use cases, so they can get started quickly and easily, especially if they haven't worked with JIRA before. If we take HR as an example, you can see the foundations are pre-built for you. The employee onboarding template has a specific issue type called employee with the matching onboarding workflow, while the recruitment template has candidates instead of employees, plus workflow stages that go from application to final hiring decision. Now, you can kick off your project with a pre-configured template like this and stick with this workflow, or you can completely customize your process. It's up to you. With workflows, match your project to your team's unique ways of working. You can create rules and conditions for how work moves through these stages and can scale up and down to make it as simple or complex of a process as you'd like. After you've created a project, you can shape your work in a variety of ways. So you've got a list, a calendar, a board, and a timeline. Let's start with list view. This is our modern take on the spreadsheet. From here, it's really easy to see all the details of your tasks in one place without needing to click into them one by one. You can easily edit tasks in line, you can navigate with your keyboard just like you would a spreadsheet, and you can also add new tasks with the click. And if you need hierarchy, you can create epics, tasks, and subtasks to organize your work. Check out the Confluence pages that are linked to tasks too. One of the benefits of being on the Atlassian platform is just how connected you can be. Finally, your work and key information across teams can be in one place, updating live. No more hunting down docs, emails, and messages to unblock your team. If you want to add more pages, you can easily search for them directly from this field. Next, board view. The board is the simplest way to visualize the status of your team's work and the process that it flows through from end to end. If you want to make changes to your workflow, you can edit a status in line just by clicking into the title. Or if you want to adjust your workflow and add a new stage, you can click the plus button. Just like that, we've added a new stage here called approval. The best part is you're not limited to just looking at your work in terms of status. You can group by other fields, like category, for example. Now, this work is grouped by stages of the marketing funnel. You can move the columns around and minimize whichever aren't top of mind. Another popular choice is assignee. Now we've got more of a capacity management view of this work, which can be really helpful in team syncs or stand-ups. Timeline view helps you really quickly understand the start and end dates of all your work and the dependencies that exist between them. Here we can see there's a dependency between these two tasks. The landing page is blocking the launch of our advertising campaign, which means it has to be completed first. With a timeline, you can easily create dependencies between tasks within the same project like this, or you can also create dependencies across other projects, even those in JIRA software. Click into a task and you can see the dependencies not just within the project, but in JIRA software too. Here again, work is seamlessly tied together across teams. No more knowledge gaps. Last but not least for tracking work is calendar view. The calendar gives you a visual day-by-day -day view of tasks and allows teams to get a clear sense of what the coming weeks, months, and quarters will look like. Just like with other views, it's really easy to add new tasks by simply clicking into a date and typing. With the unscheduled tab, you can see the tasks that haven't been given a due date yet. Drop them directly into the calendar and make sure you never miss an important deadline. Now, check out shared release dates. This is another unique benefit of being on the same connected platform as your software teams. Our customers often tell us that when product is using one tool and a team like marketing is on another, communication breaks down.
product might release a new feature, but it doesn't always make its way across to the marketing team in time to be promoted, which ends up impacting the success of feature launches. With shared release dates, that doesn't have to happen anymore. Any upcoming releases in JIRA software are automatically synced to JIRA work management calendars, eliminating the need to manually communicate every update. Now, the marketing team is in sync automatically without ever having to leave their own project. It works the other way around, too. In JIRA software, you can see marketing tasks right alongside engineering tasks in the same board. It's important for product teams to know what's going on in the worlds of their partner teams, too. This is yet another benefit of the Atlassian platform. Everyone gets to make progress in ways that are right for them, all without losing key connectivity to people, work, and information across teams. This level of connectivity applies to automation, too. For example, we can automatically kick off work in JIRA work management based on actions that happen in JIRA software. So let's say your product team creates a new release. Not only can we show it visually on the marketing team's calendar with shared release dates, but we can also automatically create a series of go-to-market tasks for them in JIRA work management. We can even send them a Slack or Microsoft Teams message about it, or let them know via email all at the same time. When we move this release to in progress, we've just automatically created a series of go-to-market tasks for the marketing team. And not just created, but assigned them to the right people, applied due dates, and more. This is a game changer for teams like marketing, who now don't need to worry about checking in with product or potentially missing new features and changes to the roadmap. From here, there's still plenty of collaboration that needs to happen to make each launch a success. For example, the marketing team will need new illustrations to pair with their messaging. Instead of going back and forth on requirements in an email thread, the team can jump into their project shortcuts and fill out a JIRA work management form right here, zero tab switching. That design request is now automatically added as a task in the design team's project. Creating a form is as easy as heading to the Forms tab and using the drag and drop form builder that's based on custom fields for each issue type. From there, you can add automations based on these responses. So for example, if the label is ads, you can automatically assign that task to the right team member who works on ad designs specifically. Now, heading into this new design task that we just created, we can see that the team has added a live Figma file directly into the task. This gives everyone a real-time window into the work that's currently happening, so there's no more uncertainty about how things are going with each iteration. Stakeholders can leave comments and interact with the designs right from the JIRA work management task. Over to our next key team, sales. One of the most important parts of a successful launch is making sure customer facing teams like sales are enabled with all the right information. One way to do that is to create a confluence page with a breakdown of the feature and all the relevant resources. We can do that right from the pages tab in JIRA work management. Again, making the work cohesive and connected. Not only do we have all the information about the feature and links to the assets created for the sales team, but we're also able to use smart links to embed a JIRA work management form and intake new questions or requests about the feature that we haven't already answered on the page. Now, instead of fielding questions in a million different places, you can bring them all together with this one page. On top of that, you can create even more efficiency by embedding a filtered view of the JIRA work management project with just the submissions from this form. Cut down on duplicate requests by giving the sales team visibility into what's already been asked. Let's take a step back and look at how this project has evolved from just a single team's work to a truly cross-functional effort. For a higher level viewpoint, the summary view in each project gives team leads a sense of how individual teams are doing. When it gets to the cross team level, JIRA Work Management Premium offers a feature called Overviews. This has multiple teams from design to marketing to finance all in one place. The summary is a great pulse check when it comes to workload and team health. You can also choose to view the work in a calendar or timeline for a roadmap that's already been built for you. At the next level, if you've used advanced planning features in JIRA software, 
You can bring projects from across Jira software, Jira work management, and Jira service management into one helicopter view. This is when it gets even more powerful. Pair these detailed roadmaps with bite-sized status updates and summaries in Atlas, and you'll have the full picture on how all the pieces come together. The goals and projects are all linked here too, and you can automatically share these updates to Slack so everyone stays connected. Make the switch to Jira Work Management and make the most of both flexibility and visibility. We've got custom-built importers that will walk you through the steps to bring your work from siloed tools to a connected platform. With Atlassian, you can build connections between people, work, and information.